A strange thing happened at Kisumu Airport on Saturday when President Uhuru Kenyatta broke protocol and was driven without security to an undisclosed location in the company of Orange Democratic Movement leader Rayla Odinga. President Kenyatta was just about to depart Kisumu and was seeing off dignitaries. Among those in the line were Mr Odinga, who had arrived in a helicopter ahead of the president, to bid him goodbye after they attended Bruce Odiembo's burial. Mr Kenyatta arrived moments after Mr Odinga's arrival and briefly went to the VIP room as protocol officers lined up dignitaries to see him off. When the president came out and greeted two people in the line, the third, Mr Odinga drew him aside after pausing as if he had forgotten something important. Unknown to the rest of the people, Mr Odinga had organized a meeting that he had not yet informed the president of. After the briefing, Mr. Kenyatta left with Mr. Odinga and Kisumu Deputy Governor Matthew Awili. Traffic officers manning and clearing the roads had already been dismissed to the President's motorcade proceeded to Kisumu's central business district without security outriders. The road was not cleared for them and they patiently maneuvered their way through the traffic to the undisclosed location. All the while, the President's jet remained parked on the runway with its engine running.